Hi, this video will cover creating a repository in LizMap. We'll cover creating a repository using SFTP, as well as creating one using SSH. And at the end of the video, for those who are active as clients, we'll also cover using our publishing tool as well. So the first step to creating a repository uh, is to create the directory on the disk um, before we can register it with LizMap. And we're going to start uh, using SFTP. And I'm logged into our server here. And this is the default, uh, QGIS is the default um, repository that, that comes installed with, with LizMap. And we're just going to go ahead and create a new directory here. And we'll call it uh, demo. And you see here we need to set the directory permissions to be the www data owner. So set this. Okay, so we've created a directory on disk called demo and we set the permissions for the directory to be www-data. And now as a final step, we'll need to note the location of the directory that we created on disk. And here, you can see it is, we've created it in the install directory. I'm just going to copy that. And this is what we're going to enter when we register to the repository uh, with LizMap. And of course, in addition to using SFTP as we just did, we can also create the directory uh, using the command line. Uh, to do so, we just switch to the install directory and then use the make directory command to create the demo directory. And you'll see here that because I'm logged in as root, the owner of the demo directory is root, so we need to change that. Use change owner to the www data user. Okay, and just as we did via SFTP, we created the demo directory uh, and set the owner to www data. And we'll now see how to register the repository using the LizMap admin interface. Okay, so we're logged into the LizMap admin interface. And let's click uh, Create Repository and give it a name. We're going to call it Demo. Demo, and this is where we enter the folder path that we created in the previous step uh, under the install directory demo. And I'm going to load JavaScript. There's other uh, options here for you as well. And let's go ahead and click Save. And the repository has been created. Okay, with our demo repository now created, uh, we can go in and modify it to set whatever permissions we'd like on it. And now any QGIS project files and LizMap configuration files we upload to our repository directory will be available via LizMap. And so we're now ready to publish our QGIS files. Um, and in the next video, we'll take a look at publishing the files to our repository. OK, and finally, if you are an AccuGIS client, um, you have a third option, uh, which is use the publish function in your web control panel. Let's click on publish. And for a destination directory, if you click on the browser, directory browser, it takes us directly to the install directory. You see the demo directory that we created earlier. So if you wanted to create a new directory here, we just enter the name here. Let's call it demo2. And when we go then to upload our QGIS project file as well as our LizMap configuration file, this new directory will be created for us with the correct, correct permissions. Uh, it will be created on the fly when we upload our QGIS project. And once that directory is created, of course, you'll just see it uh, within the directory browser and you can upload your projects to it as well.